Okay, I'm in this tiny corner in my room. It's Wednesday. My mom photobombing in the background. My perfume bottle, which I do have to say, smells nice. I hope I didn't. Did I put any water droplets on there? Hey everybody, I'm Hannah Strumner and welcome to my official YouTube channel. Today's video is something that I have been so excited to do and haven't found the complete time to do it until now. Today I'm going to be recreating fan account edits. I had this thing pop into my brain. Recreate fan edits. I mean, it's perfect. I want to make this video to thank you all for all the kindness and support and all the time you have spent either making fan accounts, commenting on my posts, listening to my music, whatever it is, and I just want to show you how much I appreciate it. So today with my non-artistic editing self, I'm going to be editing some fan posts. Alrighty, so the first photo that I'm going to do is by a fan called Aloe's Hannah. Here is the picture that you can see of the edit and here is the original picture that you can see. As you can see this probably took a lot of time. Uh, I looked at different editing systems. We're going to go to Pixar first because I hear that's like a very popular editor. Um, I don't want to create an account because I don't want to get emails. Ooh. Okay, there's a seven day free trial. I allow access to all photos. Okay, so first, I'm looking at the photo itself, and I'm seeing that I have colored strands of hair. The eyes are colored white, and the eyebrows are outlined. Um, my shoulder has some white on it, and it says, Aloe's Hannah loves you a lot. I love you too. Let's do this. Dang. Wait, let's see what the, the color they used in the background was kind of black and white. I don't know how I'm going to do this. Honestly, I don't even know how to do this. What do I do? Um. What is this? It's did nothing. What? This isn't fair. Come on, Pixar. Draw. Oh, wait, this is probably how they, how she did the white. Okay, wait, let's see if I could do this. Please, work. Ooh. Okay, that certainly did not work. Um, Let's try a thinner brush. That didn't work either. How do you do this? I have no idea. Uh, uh wow, uh, this is really difficult. I admire you guys. Oh, wait, this has a size. That's better. But how do I get that same Hello's Hannah look? You know, like her theme looks so good. Mine looks bad. I think we got these eyebrows, but I, oh, I keep messing up. Let's draw that. Okay, perfect. I think these brows are on fleek, right? You know? You know? Um, I'm going to try to make the hair, though I have no idea what I'm doing, but I think the hair is going to be super small. And she just kind of colored the hair white. I'm getting a little better. I mean, this ain't bad. I remember, I had little white speckles on my shoulder, which look kind of like these. Well, that's too much. Um, little white specks. I think this is what it looks like. Yeah, that's better. I like this better because it's not too obvious, but it's kind of like what Alice Hannah's, Hannah did. This is really good so far. Just saying, not bragging, but you know, maybe I could be an editor. <gasps> she did my uh, eyelids a certain color. She did it like white as well, but. I don't even know what is scatter, angle, squish. I don't know what any of these are. For the eyeshadow size, it's going to be like two. Wait, what am I doing? Wait, why is it? That's not fair. It's gray. I don't want it to be gray. Come on, Pixar. Let's just apply this. And now try to do a effects. So, they're like free stuff. Ooh. This is cool, but that's not free. Noise. 
film 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 that's cool oh that's that's cute that looks like one of those aesthetic cool edits ever uh but i don't think that looks like this is cool wait what is this <gasps> i could have used that but it wouldn't be the same at all it's not as good as as hers there has to be a good one okay there's black and white <gasps> i have a editor idea so let's just apply this because that's cute I think Alice Hannah would have that. I think she's very aesthetic. Okay, oh wait, there. Hannah Strum there. <laughs> Ooh, this is gonna be good. Oh my gosh, I love this already. Uh, she's kind of like a this, wait, let's see what type of font she used. Like this, no, no. Oh yeah, kind of like this. And then she had lowercase letters. Loves you a lot. But it was all lowercase, that's a problem. Come on, Pixar. Save. I did my very, very, very first edit, and I'm so proud of myself. I just want to thank my mom and my family for this achievement. Um, my very first actually okay looking edit, you know? I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm getting there, right? Obviously, Aloe's Hannah has done a way better job than I would have ever done. So, I was scrolling through Instagram, and... I don't know if you guys know, but I tend to scroll through fan pages a lot. I love your posts, I love your edits, I freak out, I show my mom, I'm like, hey mom, look at this, this is really cool. And so, trust me, I love them. Okay, so I was on Instagram scrolling through and I saw this, this really awesome edit where I'm standing by a tree and there are like these sparkles around me, so look. I'm not even gonna explain, I'm just showing this masterpiece. This is what it looks like, and this is what the OG photo looks like. So I'm gonna have to try and transform my photograph into a copy of that edit. And I think it's gonna be hard because I don't know how I'm gonna get all the sparkly stars and everything. Um, I'm trusting Pixar because I feel like lots of people I see on Instagram, people talking about Pixar a lot, though I have no clue on how to use it at all. I hear the word overlays, like a terminology, but I don't even know really what that is. So, question, if you guys know what the terminology overlays is, comment down below, because I have no idea what it is, and I'm into video, YouTubing, editing, or whatever, but I can't even edit a single picture, let alone make any transitions. Yeah, so, don't judge. So let's take a look at this photo again and kind of analyze what it has. Um, it has stars on the side, I am wearing like this sparkly halo thing. My hair doesn't really look colored, but I do have a filter. My eyes are pretty blue, and I do have like little tiny squiggly lines in them. Uh, it looks like I'm wearing earrings. Whoa, I didn't know that. that that's really cool. I like the little two squiggly lines on my face. Um, more sparkly star, thi or yeah, more sparkly things, but they're flowers and it's kind of like bluish in the background. So we're gonna try to capture this. The image is pretty similar, the colors, though I would like to change the effects just a little bit by looking at some filters, recent canvas, what is all this? Blur, artistic, what is all this? Motion, sheer, pastel, ooh, pastel's cute. Dang, these are all the free ones. Ooh, this one's kind of close to it. Let's do this one, because my eyes are pretty blue in this. So I'm gonna do the hard part first, and do the little blue squiggly lines in this, which I have no idea how to even do. No, that doesn't work, that just looks creepy. Uh, let's see, let's do size four. That may be less creepy. Yeah, it's better. <gasps> My creation. Dun, 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 dun. I have a mustache. Let's do my earring next. So uh, let's draw. We're going to need the color black. Perfect. Whoa, girl, that that was just perfect. Um, next we have the like two lines she did so we're going to do this we're gonna make it white i'm gonna kind of try to see if there's a way to make it glow a little bit i don't oh come on i don't understand how you guys don't get so frustrated with this this is so difficult wait let's try this again <sighs> compose yourself hannah you're on camera 
Okay, we're back. I'm trying to calm myself down a little bit. Taking some deep breaths. Ooh, wait, this is cool. Alrighty, I don't know how you guys have so much patience, man. But these, see how this is more thick? I wanna capture how it's thinner. And just like, okay, well, that's the closest I'm, like, I'm gonna get. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not as good as the original editor on this beautiful picture. I am excited because I feel like I might be able to edit the little star things or flowers because I was looking here and I see that there are some stars. <gasps> Whoa, these are actually cool. This could be kind of close to it. If I can color these stars a certain color or make them instead of black, I can make them a nice. Okay, so these are cool. And then she also had uh, some flowers on the upper side. So I'm going to get some flowers. Are there any flowers? Come on, there has to be some sort of flower. Dang it. Oh my gosh, we're so close. So I'm just gonna do these little square things and just see what happens. Let's just do this. Yeah, this is cool. This is a little kind of like similar to when she did the flowers. And then, oh, she did that halo thing on my head. So we're gonna have to find something thin enough to do a halo. Wait, did that work? I think that worked. Apply. I think this is kind of looking close to the actual edit. I do know that there is a different filter, so I'm gonna try to do a different filter, but I don't know. I think this Dodger one is actually gonna look pretty similar to what I had. I'm saving this baby. And now looking at her edit, you could totally see the big difference and who's more experienced, obviously she is. But she had these stars and the stars were a lot smaller, less noticeable. Um, the flowers were totally less noticeable and they were very perfect because they blended in with everything. It wasn't just like this big clump of what is this. Alrighty, so this is the very last edit that I'm doing and I'm very excited. This one's a lot different than anything that I have ever done before and I'm ready to take take that risk. I kind of looked at what overlays mean and I think that means you put something over the picture and this appears to have one of those overlay things. So here's the edited photo as you can tell it's perfect amazing and here is the original photo that you can tell as well and now I am ready to get started with the editing I'm ready for the last edit I can do this I got this so when I was on PixArt I saw that they have this setting or this filter that makes it look like it's moving. So it's like a blur or a zoom. So see how it like kind of moves? Uh, but it looks like it's moving more. There, that's cool. Got it. I think that's gonna be the one. Um, and now we have to do those two lines. Hey, wait, I do have an idea. It's not gonna look the exact same, but it could have some same look to it. So I know it had like a black outline. And there was like some sort of shape. I told you guys, I'm terrible at this. I guess I'll have to like color inside. Come on, Hannah, you got this. You got this. Apply. What is this? What in the world is this? Now time to rate my beautiful creation. I got the shaking feeling correctly, actually. I didn't get the filter correct. That's what I missed. And if you look at those like tears that I made, yeah, I think I think I know what you're thinking too. I'd probably say that's like a bad, bad grade. Yeah, I, I don't know what to grade it. My drawing just bombed completely, like seriously bomb um but if you do like this video please give it a big thumbs up comment down below what your favorite remake edit was or if you were featured in this video if you guys want to be featured in my next video if i ever make a video of me recreating fan edits again please let me know your instagram tag me in your edits and you might just find yourself one day in my video i'll see you guys next time and thanks for tuning in bye everybody